In this video, I am going to show you the best passing play in Madden 21. What's up guys, my name is Cody and I want to thank you for taking the time to watch this video. Now if you're brand new to my channel, basically what my channel is all about is helping you become a better Madden player through doing tips like this that help you get better on the offensive side of the ball and on the defensive side of the ball in Madden 21. So if you're looking to get better at Madden 21, make sure that you hit that subscribe button at the bottom right hand corner of your screen. Okay guys, so I wanted to share with you the best passing play in all of Madden 21, and I want to basically show you this through the lens of two uh, things here real quick. So what we're going to do is do different zone drops and show you really this is not just the best passing play, but it has a couple of the best passing routes in the entire game. So we're just going to come out here in nickel 335 wide. Um, I'm going to grab uh, a couple of different better, you know, a couple of different path passing linebackers. Um, and then we're going to uh, basically put that cover four show two in there. Well, we're going to start with this Mike Blitz three, um, which is, in my opinion, one of the best defensive plays in the entire game. But this play comes to us from the Raiders playbook, and the play is PA boot over out of bunch tight end. Now, I know what you're thinking. You're thinking we're just going to talk about the delay fade. Not so. In today's video, we're going to talk about what makes this play even better than just the delay fade, and that is actually the crossing route in this play. And I want to share with you why this is the best passing play in Madden 21. Now, yes, the setup is very simple. All you're going to do is you're going to delay fade your tight end. Um, and real quick, just so you know, I'm actually working on a ebook right now, about halfway done with it, out of the bunch tight end, breaking this down. And so far, in running the trials of this playbook, I've thrown for pretty much over 300 yards every single game with this offense. And it's the, the most simple offense that I've ever ran in my life. And it's really, truly embodying, embodying the idea of keep it simple, simplicity, and a return to kind of just a, a simple way to play the game. So if you're looking for a simple offense that is ridiculously good, this offense is really, really good. So text me if you have any interest in the offense, uh, the full scheme. But really simple. Literally all we're going to do is we're going to delay fade the tight end. Now, if I want you to watch Devontae Adams. You notice that I put those flats at 25 yards. All we're going to do is we're going to wait here uh, until right about there, and we're just going to pass lead this thing up. Uh, and as you can see right there, as long as we can basically click onto the receiver, we can swerve catch that against any coverage in the entire game. Um, and I'll show you, I'll go through and show you different coverages that the defense can use. But we'll show you that one more time. I probably threw that just a, a smidge too early. But if you just sit here and wait, you'll notice, again, right there. That's what we're looking for. Click on and secure catching on the sideline. So that's 25-yard seam flats, which are some of the best zones in the entire game. Um, now I want to show you 24-yard quarter flats, right? Cover four. We all, we all like cover four. Cover four is a good defense. So I'll show you this against cover four. Now cover four will do a little bit better of a job. But if you watch here, you'll notice that you can, on the cover four side of things, you can actually throw that on the sideline. You can also hit it over the top um, against the cover four defense. And the cover four will probably do the best job out of any because that corner on the outside there does a pretty good job. But again, here you see if I try to throw it over, because that corner is in a deep blue, he's going to do a better job at stopping this. But let me show you this against Tampa 2, and then we'll come back to cover four for just a second. Um, against Tampa 2, you're going to notice again, um, there's just no way that this is going to get stopped. As you see right there, that cloud flat's not going to be able to get back. And we're going to come back to Tampa 2 here in just a second. Um, and then uh, really quickly here, we'll show you like just standard coverage or man coverage. This is why you want to put your best wide receiver in that slot. As long as it's your best wide receiver, he will get separation. Uh, route technician does help this route or slotomatic. Both of those will help the route get a little bit more open. So if you have that, uh, that would be my recommendation. Another thing that you can do is, or I want to show you is really quickly, let me show you what happens when the defense runs curl flats, right? Curl flats are play a little bit differently than seam flats. So I just shaded up so I could get curl flats. And I just want you to watch what happens here with Devontae Adams. It's the same exact thing. I'm going to get over here. And again, that curl flats is not going to stop me. As you see right there, wide open, laser for me to throw that football. Now I want to come back to the cover four really quickly here and really the cover four, um, like I said, it does the best job that, of any defense that I've ever played, just that outside quarter. But what you should be able to do is basically throw it on the sideline. As you can see right there, the outside quarter is in position to guard it. So then what I like to do with this play, number one, you can hit the running back. 
uh, or not the running back. Number two, you can hit the delay fade. But number three, and, that, and again, that outside quarter zone will kind of hang with that crossing around. It's probably the only zone in the game that will hang with it. But the other thing that you're going to be able to do here is you actually have a shot uh, to hit this hit this route to Valdez Scantling. Now, um, the, the, the one thing you've got to realize about this is you have to time when you want to roll out, in my opinion, with this offense. You don't just want to roll out because if you just roll out, you're not going to be able to throw these other routes. You want to sit here, then roll out, and if you do that, you see you got a pretty good shot. Now, again, I'm getting hit as I throw, so it's not really giving me what I want. Uh, practice mode is absolutely insane to try to do stuff in because of the, sh of the sheds. So let me just kind of call off the dogs just a little bit here. Um, but, again, if you wait, 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 wait. And hard pass lead up and over top. Click on. You got a decent chance. You get you got a chance. Now again, if I play cover four ten times, I'm not gonna run this play. I might run another play, or I might do something else in this play, like hit the drag route that's wide open, or hit, um, or hit the delay fade. Now the one thing with that crossing route, just so you know. Um, that this does beat cover four. If you look at this crossing route, if you throw the ball like right there, you see you can hit that against cover four. And the last thing I wanted to do is I wanted to show you this play against a cover, like a Tampa 2 style defense um, with those cloud flats shaded back. So I'm going to drop my cloud flats back to 25 yards, come out of nickel 335 Tampa 2, and show you this. Now while I'm doing this, again, if you want to get access to full offenses and full defense completely for free shoot me a text message my number is 812-216-3644 every week in our text message membership we release schemes um, that basically expand on the videos so if we have like this bunch tied in for example if we're going to do something on this we'll show you this play but then we'll show you about three to four other plays that basically can put, put a, a whole scheme together around it now in our last one we did a nice little uh trips tied in offensive scheme so it's really really effective but anyway, here's Tampa 2. Just want to show you this real quick. And as you can see, and again, give me some grace on that. I got shedded like crazy. Um, you've got to learn, with this play in particular, you have to learn the importance of staying in the pocket for a second. A lot of people like to roll out. You really need to stay in the pocket until the play breaks down. If you don't, you're not going to be able to hit this route. But as you can see right there, that's what we're looking to do. On the sideline, easy read. Now, if I go to cover three and I turn these into cloud flats, you see there's the cloud flats, and I just want to show you how this plays. The cloud flats play it really, you know, probably the best. But again, he turns as soon as that corner turns, you can kind of get this in. Now, again, I got to throw that a little bit. I got to throw that a little bit more to the sideline than I did. Um, but what you should notice about this is the window of opportunity is there. Now, again, if the play breaks down, I can throw the drag. I can throw other routes, but that's the route I want to throw every time if I can because that's the most powerful route in this play. So what happens then is they may go to some, you know, whatever, man coverage, something, right? Um, and then what you're going to do, the play break down, okay, you're going to roll out, they start chasing you, and you're going to throw your delay fade. That's kind of how it works. So make them go use the crossing route, then you start working the delay fade. But that's it for the video. Thanks for watching. I want to invite you to our live stream tonight at 10 o'clock p.m. Eastern time. We're going to be streaming. I'm going to be running this offense so you can see it more in real time. Um, like I said, it's super simple. Super, super simple, but super, super effective. And if you want to get more offenses and defenses from me, go ahead and shoot me a text message. I'd love to be able to send you the playlist we have. These are full schemes over an hour long for each video that go in-depth into the scheme and break down why it is good. Thanks for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it, and we'll see you guys um, in our next video.